Kia ora, tēnā koutou katoa. Ko Michael Dudley, toko ingoa, no Tech Collect NZ. Hello and greetings to all. My name is Michael Dudley from Tech Collect NZ, a not-for-profit organisation established by leading global technology companies investing in the circular future of their products in Aotearoa. While our origins lie in e-waste management, focusing on end-of-life recovery and treatment, we're committed to supporting a more circular economy in New Zealand by managing our e-products and components to achieve their highest value for as long as possible. In July this year, the New Zealand government declared six priority products for the establishment of regulated product stewardship schemes under our Waste Minimisation Act, including electrical and electronic products. This announcement also came with news of grant funding for Tech Collect NZ to expand our e-way service across Aotearoa and work with industry, government and community stakeholders to co-design regulated scheme options for e-products through a targeted research and consultation process. To commence the co-design approach, we've convened a circular e-stewards network. This network brings together a cross-section of local and global product stewardship experts, New Zealand government, community and industry stakeholders with the goal of developing, refining and recommending regulated scheme options that are fit for purpose in New Zealand. The network will be directed by a central working group who will produce a recommendations report for a preferred model or preferred models by June 2021. The network will also hold four engagement workshops to consult on certain issues and opportunities and capture stakeholder feedback and recommendations for proposed scheme design elements. These workshops will take place in early and mid 2021 and will be widely promoted to ensure that all interested parties and potentially impacted groups can actively participate and are well represented. If you're wondering what products might be captured by the term electrical and electronic products, the scope is quite broad and basically covers any device with a plug or battery, including batteries themselves. E-products excluded from our investigations relate to large batteries used in electric vehicles and energy storage. Circular product stewardship design options for these products are being led by our friends at the Battery Industry Group or Big Network. To quickly run through some of the key deliverables the Central Working Group are leading, we will undertake stakeholder engagement to understand stakeholder views on the key requirements for a scheme in NZ, research learnings from international approaches informing local scheme design, undertake consumer research to understand consumer beliefs, attitudes and behaviours towards e-product lifecycle management, analyse legal issues that may impact our e-management sector in future, and prepare a recommendations report for the best options by June next year. With our stakeholder engagement activities now underway, I invite and encourage everybody to head to our website and register your interest to participate in our stakeholder surveys and upcoming workshops in the new year. We want to make sure that we leave no stone unturned throughout these investigations and your valuable input is crucial to achieve this. Namahi nui.